Three years after the fall of Jerusalem and the temple, when an arch of triumph was erected in Rome to commemorate the great victory of the Romans over Judea, yet 960 men, women and children zealots were holding that cliff of Masada against the whole might of the Roman Empire. They wanted to be free men. But when the inevitable, inevitable end came, they decided to take their life in their own hands. This amazing story was recorded brilliantly by the historian, Jewish historian Josephus Flavius. And to this day, it is a place of pilgrimage. I had the honor and privilege to excavate the site completely, and in fact, all the discoveries which we made prove that the story of Josephus Flavius was uh, correct. It is in the most important place archaeologically because everything is absolutely dated. But for us, for Jews, Israelis living today in Israel, it has a much more another significance, not only an archaeological. It is a challenge, it is a reminder also. It is for this reason that the armored corps of the Israeli army are taking the oath of allegiance to the state of Israel on top of Masada, saying, Masada shall not fall again. This is the so-called Masada complex that we have. We want to live free people.